Right. So splices, you know, with big belts. Uh, what's what's Fender Dunlop manufacturing and offering with regard to splices? So we have an offering of bulk bulk materials, uh, twenty eight inch and sixty three inch wide, uh, from various gauges from thirty nine thousandths to two seventeen. Um, we also have various groups and compounds that mm-hmm. Ronnie will dive into. Um, we supply noodles uh, for steel cords and finger splices. And we also um, handle all the accessories like the splicing paper, fabrics, things of that nature. Yeah. So when you, so I'm a customer and I, I've, I've bought a belt from you and, and we know we've got to do uh, splices, right? right. And, and these days it's, it's usually more than one mm-hmm. uh, with the length of the belts that are happening. Right. So uh, I get, I get a kit or I get procedures or what, what do you supply to me as, as the customer? So you can get it in multiple, like say you can buy it in bulk and build your own, or you can get a specific kit uh, specifically formulated for the belt you're splicing. Yeah. Uh, we offer steel cord kits. I think we were talking about it earlier. Um, they can be up to 10 foot uh, in a crate, up to 10 foot long, four foot wide and three foot tall so really large kits down to uh small step kits okay yeah with steel cable belting it's very important that we when you get the kit it's pre it's it's got a panel uh so those panels are already pre-made right and so you have a top panel bottom panel and that's what uh they do in bluefield is they build that gauge up yeah. So that it's laid out uh, properly, and 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 all all the material inside the splice kit is labeled, and so that's important that it has that that expiration date, and it matches the compound that the conveyor belt's made up. Well, I I was I was going to ask about that because I'm assuming, you know, you guys are manufacturing the belt, mm-hmm. so who would know better what the best uh material uh you know with your knowledge of the belt i i would think that the splice kit you provide would be you know custom yeah. made would be the right the right one for that belt yeah we we have different we have a, what we call groupings right okay and so there's up to 12 groupings of compounds okay. and so it can range from a general purpose compound which is a, a everyday aggregate application up to a government regulations, which would be a, 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 a government regulation for fire resistance. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And so you can't mix and match those groupings. And yeah. what makes us uh, exceptional is that each uh, compound is labeled with a different color plastic. Okay. So it, it reduces those chances of cross contamination yeah. within a kit yeah. or bulk material. And yeah. so that's a that's a plus for for the industry today.